648 replaced words. In English, we have a concept called root, which can be followed by some other words to form another longer word. Let's call this word successor. For example, the root and followed by another. Followed by other can form another word another. Now, given a dictionary consisting of many roots in a sentence, you need to replace all the successor in the sentence with the root forming it. If successor has many roots, can form it, replace it with the root with the shortest length. You need to replace the sentence after the replacement. For example, you have a dictionary of this. You have the sentence, and then you have this other thing. Okay, I suppose. Uh, I mean, this seems like a very standard e try type thing. Uh, yeah. And some of that is whether uh, excuse me whether we need a try or do we can go a little uh, dumber. But let's see. Oh, that okay. So that is. Um, less than a thousand, less than a thousand words. Root length. Okay. Yeah, I feel like we could actually, I mean, you could probably do a try for optimization, but I'm going to try to do the naive thing first and then see what happens. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I, won't, I mean, I'll still do something dumbish, but not too. Like, I'll have one optimization. Uh, oh, this is a list. Let's do this just because it's a bit. Actually, I can just mean it just here. I set that I set I guess I'll just try that. I forget which bicep I need. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna just print it out. This will be a learning lesson for me too. Uh so that it, Ideally, I'm gonna bring my navy place to the shortest one. But at least I'll, um, yeah, that should give us at least a, uh, a prefix inferior. Right? I would also say if I was like doing a competitive programming, I probably would just do the naive and then worry about it later. But, but not, uh, maybe I'm trying to figure out ways I could write things more concisely.
Hmm. Oh, not what I expected, actually. Actually, that's not bad. That's the one that's before. Maybe I needed the other bicep. Wait. I don't really expect it. Okay. I have some idea. What's going on? So, I don't have starts with, but maybe I'm thinking of another language. Uh, uh, thanks. Oh, that's the way I step in. Let's turn it off. Otherwise, it can say, well, Okay, so that's good. Let's uh, try some sim cases. Those are ones with uh, multiple uh, possible friends. Okay. Oh, because it stops at cat, so then it misses cat. Eh, okay, that's what I get for being clever. Uh, hmm. That's fine. Okay, fine, I just said it. Excuse me.
is this fast enough? I guess we'll see. Okay. We'll go. Cool. I guess it is fast enough. It's a little slow. But so now you think it's good enough for the medium? And it's good enough for me. Uh, okay, cool. Yeah, I think the, the trickiest part about this one is kind of just having the confidence uh, on the analysis, on kind of bounds. Um, but yeah, since the entire sentence is going to be less than a thousand characters, you could get away with like n square e things, uh, which is kind of what I do. Um, yeah, so there's n squared, there's all of n space, well, different n, where it's just the size of the dictionary of the universe, uh, and then just quite like n squared lookup-ish, uh, roughly. Um, and for a thousand, that's okay. Uh, and I think this just ends up being an implementation form after that, uh, after you have a lookup table. Um, yeah, cool. I mean, this was a fun form. Uh, is it hard enough? Yes. I mean, I, I've actually. No, I was gonna. I, I was just thinking whether this would be a uh, a good difficulty difficulty on a interview, and I definitely have actually seen not this one, but but uh, very similar ones where uh, it's like, you know, given a sentence, um, uh, given a sentence, and here's like a, a mapping from A to B, uh, or list of mappings from A to B. Uh, you know, what what does the new sentence look like, right? So that's. Uh, so definitely have seen those problems, so definitely uh, be prepared for that, but it should be okay. I mean, if you're prepared, then, you know, this is very straightforward. Not sure why it's a medium. Hmm. Maybe there's some clever, clever -er algorithm it wants you, well, if it wants you to do, uh, I mean, the, the the less intense file is to create a, a try, but, uh, but I didn't, so. <laughs> But that would probably make justify the thing on medium and definitely on an interview I would talk about you know using a try um, and maybe even do implement a try and then you know you get one the end nodes and that's how you you know break up apart uh, and you could and on that note you could even terminate early because you know that you know you don't have to ch keep on checking uh, the prefixes uh, you know that when you look at the node there's no character anymore right so you don't continue on the next one. Um, 